If we select the run on this smart client application, it will bring the application across if it's the first time you run it. And here you can then open up any of the WinForm data and interact with it. We can drain the tank, take a look at the trend component. Again, this system is connected to that same data set in Texas. So we're looking at live data here. So if we take a look at that smart client application that we built earlier, let's bring it up here. You can see it's the same data that we have with the example smart client. If we go to the alarms page, we can acknowledge alarms from this system and we'll see the acknowledgement come back across the internet to the other system. So almost as fast as I'm acknowledging these alarms, the, the return is returned in the other application. Also if we go to menu symbols, we'll see that when I click on this pump button, you'll see the feedback occurs very quickly to the other application. The next time your clients run the application you've deployed as a smart client, they can either do that from the web page that you provided them or from the program group of the WinForm application itself because we chose to run the application also in an offline mode. So it will appear here in the start menu. When we launch that application, it goes out to the central service, checks to see if there's a new version available. If there is a new version, it'll bring it across. If there isn't, it will just run the application. So in this example, the application just appears. Now let's see what that looks like if we have a new version. So you can picture you've deployed your application to several hundred customers all over the world. Now we simply increment the revision number by one and publish the application again. Now you don't have to go out to any of the client computers to install anything. They will be updated for the next time they run the application. Here's the web page that is generated. Here you can see the version number has been incremented. Let's instead run the application from the start menu. And here we can see the user is prompted that there is a new version available. They can choose skip to ignore or click OK to begin the download process of the new version and then the application will run for them. If you have any further questions about smart client deployment, you're welcome to contact us at opcsystems.com. We have representatives located all over the world to assist you. You can find them under the sales page at opcsystems.com. For a 30-day evaluation of opcsystems.net, visit opcsystems.com. For a free version of Microsoft Visual Studio Express, visit microsoft.com.